but um yeah all that stuff i just said is blacklisted and you cannot get that type of clothing uh it won't let you transfer it online sometimes you got to be careful because like sometimes it could be wearing a, a body armor or something and then you know you can't bring it online also something else is blacklisted is like those that hair that goes around the, the hand that's also blacklisted but um yeah just be careful because sometimes that stuff is uh, covered up so you gotta like make sure and really look at the outfit and just make sure that nothing on it is blacklisted all right i'm gonna go ahead and freeze the curse mask and get and get some outfits but um yeah you can just freeze the curse mask get some outfits and all that but i'll get back to you guys once i've frozen the mask and got in my outfits all right so these are the outfits that i got i froze the mask i froze the penguin mask and i got the blue and tan joggers okay once you have gotten all the outfits that you want to get um just simply go on the outfit that you want to bring online first and then just click x to bring it inside of story mode okay you can get up to 10 outfits okay by doing the multiple outfit glitch so you, all you need to do is just freeze the mask once and you can get you know up to 10 outfits and that's pretty good and then just do the multiple outfit glitch that i'll link in the description and you can get all those uh, outfits but uh once you look inside of director mode just run around for at least 30 seconds okay the reason why it's so important to run uh for at least uh, 30 seconds because it decreases your chance of you getting blue screen or your game crashing you could run up to even two minutes and that will even decrease uh your chance of uh, getting blue screen even more all right um so yeah a lot of people will make videos on this and they just leave straight as they get inside of direct mode you don't want to do that because then you have a really high chance of getting a blue screen or your game crashing so that's why I just run around for 30 seconds and then you should have a lower chance of your game crashing but um once you run around for a decent amount of time just open up your interaction menu go to quit director mode and then just accept the alert all right now you should spawn inside of story mode with the modded outfit if your game does crash and you do get blue screen you will need to restart yeah it does suck but it happens to all of us all right just try it again and then you will get it now you just want to run around for another 30 seconds and um yeah just run around just to make sure that you know your game doesn't crash um but yeah once you've run around for a decent amount just uh you want to create a game save all right this is just to make sure a hundred percent that your shortlist um actors don't go away okay just uh make a game save inside of story mode with the modded outfit just to make sure that those outfits save inside of your shortlist okay now press your pause menu go to online and then go to invite only session and then once your screen freezes press the psn button go down go to the right go down and then accept the izzy job okay you just click x on the izzy job all right and now once your screen flickers and it unfreezes you should get the live tile alert okay so you can see my screen's about to unfreeze right now it unfreezes and then i should get so as you can see guys fail to connect to the live talk on it return to grand theft auto 5 all right now the reason why i created a game save inside of story mode with the modded outfit is because a lot of you guys were saying that your outfits would uh, disappear now with this trick 100 percent your outfits will save inside of your shortlist okay if you create a game save inside of story mode with the modded outfit it will it will 100 percent save okay because a lot of you guys were saying that your outfits were you know disappearing and stuff but um yeah once you load inside of story mode uh just make sure you fully load in so you get any phone calls just decline them and then now just close your application again so press the present button press on gta and then close application and then once you close the app just simply load into online okay don't load into story mode you guys just simply want to load online so i'll, I'll get back to you guys once i load online Now, once you load online, if you want to shower, just get out of it. But a lot of you guys pretend that once you load it online, you, you guys got in, an alert that kicked you to story mode. Now, I actually did get it while I was doing the glitch 60. I'm gonna get this alert right now. Now, if you do get this alert, just don't accept it, just close your app. So, just uh, close your application. So, press your PSN button, press Option GTA, and then close it. And then now you want to load into story mode okay don't load online because you, you're just gonna get the same alert over and over again okay just load into story mode and then i'll get back to you guys once i load to story mode now once you spawn 
spawn inside a story mode, if you spawn like me all glitched out, it's fine if you don't, it's fine, it doesn't really matter. Just um, press your pause menu, go to game, go down to load game, and you want to load a game that has no modded outfits inside of the shortlist, okay? So just a fresh new game, uh, just start up a fresh new game, and then it should load you into story mode again, so I'll get back to you guys once I load into story mode. Now, once you guys load into story mode, just press your pause menu, go to online, and then you want to load inside of an invite-only session. Okay. Now, the reason. Now, if you guys don't have a fresh game, just start a new game and then make a save. All right. So I'll, I'll get back to you once I load in online. All right. So as you can see, guys, I loaded in with the modded outfit. Um, if this video helped you, uh, please smash that like button, subscribe to my channel, and then leave a comment what other video you guys want to see. But yeah, other than that, uh, this has been the glitch. I, I do have a modded account for sale. I will leave it in the description. The modded account video, I still haven't sold it. So if you're interested in it, you know, you can go ahead and buy it and just contact me on Instagram. But uh, yeah, this is the glitch. Uh, if you guys are still confused about that fresh game, uh, what you want to do is just create a new game, alright? So press your pause menu, go to game and then create a new game and they just want to create a new game save all right that's just a fresh game it has no modded outfits inside of that game save so that's just to help the glitch out okay but uh yeah uh if you guys need help on that new new game save or whatever that fresh game save just leave it in the comments i will help you because it is a little bit confusing but um yeah other than that um this has been the glitch thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you guys in the next video peace out